Hello students, how are you all? Hope you all are fit and healthy. We are doing chapter 12, Smart Chunk. I already completed this chapter in my last video. इस chapter में हमने क्या सीखा? इस chapter में हमने tally mark बनाना, pie chart, how to create it, and bar graph. So, three things we understand in this chapter, that tally mark, pie chart, and bar graph how to create it now today i'm going to explain you this chapter chapter 12 smart charts let's do homework your workbook page number is 167 so open your workbook and see the first question the weight of four students is shown in the following bar graph Write the name of the bars on the basis of the details given here. Here you can see a bar graph is given here. But on the basis of these two questions, we have to create a bar graph. Here is not going to show us the measurement, the name, the student, nothing. According to these two questions, we have to create this. Is two question ke according, we have to create bar graph. Create karna hai. How we can do? So, listen here, concentrate. Now, see the first question. First, it's mentioned, Bela has the minimum weight that we have to write here. Here is given weight of the student. According to us, we have to write here the weight of student. That's I wrote here 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 and 30. That means 5, 5, 5 difference between the this bar graph, this square. And here you have to mention the name. Mention the name. How to mention the name? According to this question. This question ko pad ke samaj ki hum ko is bar graph mein student ka name mention karna hai. So, Bela has the minimum weight. Where is the minimum weight? This is the minimum. Ye sabse less hai. So, that is this is the Bela weight. So, here you have to write Bela and the student name is Bela. Both side you have to write the so, this is the minimum. The first one is Bela weight. Okay. So, here you have to write. Now, see the second one. This question you have to understood. So, this listen carefully. Payal's weight is less than Amisha but more than Hetal. Concentrate here student. Payal's weight, Payal ka weight, Amisha ki weight se kam hai. But, Hetal ki weight se jada hai. More than means, Hetal ki weight se jada hai. So, pile, pile you have to write here because according to question, pile's weight is less than Amisha weight. Amisha ke weight se kya hoga? Pile ka weight kam ho jayega. And the hair more than Hetal hai. Hetal ke weight se pile ka weight more hai. So, according to this second question, pile you have to write here because pile weight is less than Amisha and more than Hetal. So, here you have to write name Amisha, Payal, Hetal and the less one is Bela. So, here also you have to mention Amisha, Payal, Hetal and Bela. So, this four is a girl who are student and the weight according to our measurement that's only you have to write. But this is the question and according to your question this paragraph you have to fill with student name. Hope you understood this first one. Now, see the second question. Second one is student of standard 5 and 8, 5 to 8. Okay, see 5 to 8 means 5, 6, 7 and 8. In one school have collected some amount to relief fund. Detail of fund is shown in the following table. This is the table. So, this is the detail of the fund. Complete the bar graph and answer the question. According to this detail, according to this table, we have to make a bar graph, complete a bar graph. Then after, we have to give the questions answer. So, let's turn your page and see on a next page, your workbook page number 160. Now, see the, this is the bar graph and here is given amount. And standard. 5th standard, 6th standard, 7th and 8th standard. 1000, 2000, 3000, 4000, 5 and 6000. This is the amount of fund. So, here you have to notice 5th standard student collect 3000 amount according to your question. So, make a user scale and make a bar graph. 
Then after six standard student collect six thousand amount of fund. So make a scale and make a this type of rectangle boxes. Bar graph that's called. Seven thousand seven standard student collect two thousand fund amount. So make a bar graph. Eight standard student collect four thousand amount of fund. So make a bar graph. According to your question, I completed this bar graph. आपके question में ये कम mention है कि fifth standard का student three thousand collect किया है, sixth standard का student ने six thousand fund collect किया है, seventh standard का student two thousand and eighth standard collect four thousand amount of fund. So according to this, you have to make this bar graph. Now see the question. The first question is. Which standard has the collected the high amount? So which standard collected six six standard? It's because six standard collect the six thousand. That is the high amount of fund. So here you have to write standard six. Which standard has collected the least amount? Least means less. So seven standard collect the least amount. There is only two thousand. सबसे कम में collection है. Which standard has collected Half of the amount of standard six. So which standard collected the half of the amount of standard six? Standard six collected the six thousand. So six thousand का half कितना होता है? Three thousand. So fifth standard, fifth standard is collected the half amount of six because fifth standard have a three thousand and sixth standard have six thousand. So here you have to write standard fifth. Which standard has collected double the amount of standard seven? Which standard collected the double amount? Double amount means seventh standard का amount कितना है? Two thousand and the double if we do the double then four thousand. So four thousand amount किसका है? Standard eight. So standard eight collected the double amount of the standard seven. So my dear student, hope you all understood this chapter. Complete your chapter.